Hello everyone and welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial. In this one I'll be showing you how to build an elevator using the trident and of course the riptide enchantment that it has on it. Uh, but before we get into it I've got a little bit of a bug to show you. Okay just gonna hold down shift just gonna make that trident float up there. Not a problem. Not a problem. Um, Mojang fix your game. No no it's it's okay we understand there'll be bugs of course the game is still in development right now which is something that i should mention we're in snapshot 18w10d this could be subject to change in the future it seems unlikely since the riptide enchantment is pretty solid but if you are watching this video in the future uh, keep in mind this may have changed so let's show you the elevator in action all you got to do is walk into it look upwards hold down right click let go and in one and a half seconds you will be at the top which is uh, 30 or 31 blocks higher pretty fantastic right this design concept was sent to me by that master gaming if you're watching the video thank you for sharing they asked if i'd seen this design around or anyone else doing it um, i hadn't i had a look at their video which you can watch in the description box down below and i managed to suss out what it was they were doing and kind of work on the design a little bit just simplify it and make it super easy to use so this is kind of very close to the original concept um, that they showed so you can go up by 30 blocks if you don't have a post at the bottom I put a fence post in over here it allows you to go just one block higher which is probably not really something you need to worry about and as I already said you can go from the bottom to the top in one and a half seconds now you don't need all of these blocks around like this you don't need the tube all you need is the thing at the bottom and the thing at the top of course it'll need to be directly above so if I go in here look upwards hold down right click and again just bam one and a half seconds we're all, all the way at the top here and uh, over to the right hand side I've got an even more simplified version of this design basically I just kept simplifying things as I was going along right um, so if we stand here look upwards hold down right click we go all the way to the top and it is super super simple now let's change to creative mode and you can see some of the design progress here um, we were using a trapdoor at first to hold back the water I don't know why I didn't think of using a sign it doesn't have a hitbox it's easy to place and so because of that you needed one down the bottom here if you were to walk any further forward than that then you would potentially hit the trap door at the top so then we use a sign and the sign hold back to the water which is pretty simple so you've got the sign there uh, you've got the water here and then a block gap above it and this block at the top is extremely important because the trident is actually going to hit that block and when it does so you'll be in the water and you don't even have to move the player you'll just get naturally pushed over into this little spot where you can jump out and so you can see everything that you need to build this right as far as the tutorial goes I'm in place three blocks water and a pressure plate so from there we want to count upwards and we're going to start counting at this height right here the 30 blocks that I mentioned earlier is from this height to where you land at the top so let's count 1 2 3 25 26 27 28 29 and 30 so when you've counted 30 blocks upwards that's where you'd put the sign now the top bit is super simple we've got those three blocks again the sign to hold back the water uh, a block in front of it to hold back the water as well on top of that again the three blocks got the water flowing into this space got some blocks around the front to contain the water and then you've got another three blocks because the air block there is essential and then you have a block at the top so I should also mention that you can use the loyalty enchantment as well there was one occasion where the trident seemed to come out of the contraption at the top and fall back down on the ground which is actually a pain in the butt if you are uh, trying to go somewhere up there after right so I recommend putting the loyalty enchantment on it as well but I've done this hundreds of times and it only once did it disappear with the riptide enchantment on by itself but that's it you know that's everything you need to know it's that simple which is why it's so awesome so if you enjoyed uh, this video leave a like be sure to check out that uh, master gamers video as well there's a link to it in the description box and if you're looking for more useful tutorials there is a link to the playlist in the description box as well but anyway that's it from me thank you for watching this video and i'll see you in the next one Bye bye